hello everyone this is satvik and welcome back to the new video and in this video this uh, video will be discussing about a cool tool called as phone book so as the name suggests it lists all the domains so what the only thing that you need to provide here is like a subdomain so for example if you are if your target is netflix.com or if your target is like tesla.com like just give the domain and uh, it is going to give you like the, all the subdomains and also the email addresses so previously i used to use this tool for like email osint like there are some other tools in order to uh, find out the emails like the harvester and some stuff like that but most of the times they the output that they are providing is not much reliable and also it also provides you some urls from uh, some kind of like way back urls kind of output just a kind of and uh, all you need is like just a domain and also guys uh, this site may be uh, like uh, under maintenance sometimes like when i checked it checked it in the last month like it was un under the maintenance but now it is working fine and also in order to use this uh, application or use this website and also in order to use this application you should have an account in this website called as intelligence x so even this intelligence x is a kind of like uh like some kind of osint and it does some kind of uh, pen testing stuff pen testing related stuff so you need to have an account in that so all you need is an email and uh, once you get once you provide that you will be able to log in and uh, you will be uh, given an option to uh, provide the input and you can check for the stuff so the first one which i use mostly in this website or using this tool is email addresses so you can just provide something like a simple domain name for example netflix.com so click on submit and within like a blink of uh, uh, within a blink of an eye you can see so many output uh, so many output like so many emails uh, which are uh, based on this netflix.com domain so you may be having doubt like satvik i can find out the email uh, these kind sort of emails like on uh, many uh, what you call uh, from many websites and stuff but i can guarantee you that the output or the flick uh, the output that this particular tool is providing is like more like you can see there are a ton of emails here like uh i'm also giving it giving you a clarity that all of these emails may not be valid because some of the employees or some of the mails may be for testing and some of the employees uh who bear this email addresses may be off boarded okay so there is a good chance so if you want to find out so you need to use some kind of an email validator from email hippo or something like that so that's your task so you, need, you can validate them and you can uh, look for the stuff like you can look for some uh, data breaches uh, i already made a video on a cool tool called as dhashed so dhashed is a tool which provides you all the breach data so for that you need to have a premium subscription and also i leave the link for that tool in the description below and also guys like uh, this is one thing so email addresses is one good thing that you can do so uh, this is my primary uh, thing that i always do and the next one is the domains so domains in the sense like it gives you all the sub subdomains and also the same situation it may not all the subdomains that this particular tool is providing may not be like uh, valid okay so some of them may be off ported or some of may be are under maintenance some of them might be forbidden something like that okay so uh, that is it so you can find out so this is like you can use it like a bug bounty tool uh, to be precise okay so whenever you're doing a pen test so you can use this application and you can just copy paste all this stuff in your notepad or some application and you are good to go okay like you have a ton of information here and next goes the url so url in the sense like it provides you like all the urls okay from the way back and also from the internet some of them may, may be consisting of some kind of like some of them may be uh, consisting of some stuff like uh, 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 like some uh, sensitive information or something like that but that's the thing and also like if you have something like this so you can always uh, like uh, you can add like a wildcard like star.netflix.com and uh, you can find out all the urls from like different subdomains as well okay so star is the sense like a delimiter like if you take some government website so uh, like you have some more uh, levels and stuff like that so in those cases you can use this star and you can try to find out more information so that is it guys regarding this video so this is a short video and uh, and also i think uh, by the end of this video you if you if you are new to this tool then you may be using it in the further part cause this is very productive and also it saves you a lot of time and if you really end up liking this video make sure you like it and do subscribe to the channel for more amazing content like this this is satvik signing off i'll meet you in the next video thank you